and welcome. My name is Amanda and I'm an independent Sensi consultant and I am here today to do my unboxing of my Harvest Collection items that I purchased. Um, so I'm super excited about this. I got a couple of things for my kids that they have been waiting and dying to get their hands on because I made the mistake and told them that I got them some stuff and so they've just been bugging me and like, hey, when can I have my stuff? You know, so uh, finally getting around to unboxing this so that way I can finally give them their stuff that I promised them. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. Um, so the Harvest Collection launched on the 1st of September, which is just about like a week ago, week and a couple days. Um, so I went a little crazy. I did have a party to close out with this order, so I got a lot of this free and half off. Um, so let's just go ahead and go through it. I did get a I don't think I got this many okay so it looks like they threw in extra pods because I got one six pack of pods um, so I got there's three different fragrances in the harvest collection Three fragrances in the Harvest Collection. I got a six pack, so I got two of each fragrance, but it looks like they actually sent me two extras of the Maple Rum Cake, because I have eight pods here. I got two of the Wild for Fall. I got two Cozy Vanilla Pumpkin. And then four of the maple rum cake so I don't believe I purchased two extras I got the travel twist travel twist in the maple and rum cake uh, it says on here two of the Scentsy pod twin packs so that's these, two of them, and then Scent Circle, Fragrance Flower. Yeah, it looks like these are extras. Huh, that's interesting. Anyways, so, uh, so those are the pods and the travel twist. Next, I will... I got the um, Scent Circle 3-pack. So it comes with all three scents, and these are the 3D Scent Circles. I don't know if you can see maybe this one. You can see it a little bit better. There are actually two Scent Circles in there, and then you put them together, and it makes this like 3D little, cute little Scent Circle. So I got a pack of those, and then these, are the scent packs that came with the buddies that I got. I got Caramel Apple Craze and Cashmere and Corduroy. Um, I'll do this one next. I did get the body products that were available in Cashmere and Corduroy. I got the hand cream and the Scentsy Soak, which I absolutely love Cashmere and Corduroy, so I'm super stoked that they came out with it in the body products. I kind of wish that instead of the hand cream that they do the body cream because I do prefer the body cream over the hand cream. Um, but I'll take what I can get. Uh, so I did get a Harvest Oil 3-pack. So let's go ahead and sniff through these. Uh, the first one is Apple Cinnamon Scone. And this one is Baked Apple Folded with Cinnamon Sugar and a Splash of Cider. 
can't really see that. Ooh, yeah, there is definitely an apple cinnamon bakery scent to this. cinnamon sugar and a splash of cider. Hmm, that is really good. It smells like a baked apple pie. So that'll pair really nicely with that fragrance, baked apple pie. And then caramel cinnamon cupcake. Uh, this is a delightful confection of vanilla, maple, and cinnamon drizzled with caramel. So I, it seems like this season, they're really favoring the kind of like maple caramel cinnamon yeah because we have like the maple rum cake we have like this fragrance um we'll get into it but the scent of the month next month has like a maple drizzle or something like that um but yeah so it seems like this season they're really going like hard on the maple. Oh yeah, and you can really, I didn't even show this one to you. Cute. I really can pick up like a maple scent, like a vanilla. It's not like a harsh maple, it is like a smoother vanilla maple. And a little bit of caramel. I don't really get much cinnamon. Maybe a little hint of spice, but it's really mostly like caramel maple with like a smooth vanilla in there. So that's pretty good. And then next is vanilla raspberry potion. So an enticing elixir of vanilla and raspberry with a pinch of Divana herb. Herb, herb. So that's that one. Ooh, I definitely get an herb note. And raspberry. It's like an herbal raspberry. It's interesting. Mm. Divana. I've never heard of that. I don't know what that really smells like. But this does like have an herbal element to it. It's not as sweet, um, I guess you could say as like vanilla, raspberry kind of has a tendency to like, kind of be sweeter. This is really good. Oh, I really like this one. All three of these are really good. I might actually have to pick up another oil three pack, but super cute. I love that they come in these little tins. They're perfect for gifts. Okay. Moving on, I did pick up the fragrance flowers in all three of the scents, the cozy vanilla and pumpkin, and we'll, I'll go through the scents um, once I get to the wax, um, and then we'll sniff through everything and I'll compare the scents to the pods um, and all of that, and then also compare to the travel twist, um, and then the maple rum cake. and wild for fall. Okay. There they are. I got the hand soap three pack. You can never have too many hand soaps. Oh, I know what I did, did I? No, I didn't. No, you can't do that. Never mind. I mean, it would be on here if I did do that, but it's not, so. Anyways, uh, the hand soaps, caramel apple craze, which I'm super excited about. I love that scent. Appleberry. And Bright Cider Life, which I absolutely love Bright Cider Life, so. All right, we will move on to this guy. Um, I got the Jack-O-Lantern wall fan diffuser. 
And this is actually gonna be my first wall fan diffuser with the lights. I'm not able to plug it in and show you, but here he is, the little jack. Um, but he is a wall fan diffuser. You just take your pods, you pop them in there, one or two, and then you put this on, you plug it in, and then you hit that little button there. And this one is gonna have lights that come out of the bottom. Um, but then there's a fan in there. You can see it right there. There's a fan in there that spins and it blows through up through the pods that are in there and it releases the fragrance that way from the pods so i thought he was super super cute i didn't get the cut it out warmer that one was one that came back from last year's uh, harvest collection um but i had to have the wall fan diffuser i love these um i started out with these in my kids rooms because they're very durable um they don't have anything that spills it's just these pods um, so if it gets knocked over, um, I've had one get hit out of the wall, they go all over the floor, they get knocked over. Like You can just kind of like trust with kids and pets that these aren't going to cause a bunch of damage, they're not going to break, they're not going to spill, cause a huge mess. I absolutely love these and I would definitely recommend these for anyone with kids or pets um, that kind of have a tendency to like get into stuff or knock stuff and break stuff over um but these are amazing and i just thought this was perfect and cute and i was so excited to get that so let's go ahead and move on let's do i'm gonna do that let's do the buddies next so i got star the little black cat. Uh, this one is for my little baby, my two-year-old Kyrie. Oh my goodness, look how cute she is. She has like a little dress, a little skirt. Um, it is sewn on. You don't take the skirt off, but it is so cute. She's got her little collar with her star. And her little ears, her little face. Her face actually is more like teddy bear. I think she probably needs some whiskers, but still so very cute. And then on the back, you kind of just like lift the skirt up and the zipper is right back there for the scent pack. And her little star patch. She is so cute and so soft. Oh, I love her. Oh, Kyrie is going to love her. But this is Star. She is available still. It's part of the Harvest Collection. Um, so yeah, there she is. Her ears kind of like bent. There you go. So cute. Oh, and her tail. Okay. Kyrie is going to love her. All right, so for the first time this year, we did get Harry Potter products as part of the Harvest Collection. We got a new buddy, we got a new warmer, we also got a new fragrance in addition to everything that returned from last time Harry Potter was released. So, this little buddy is for my oldest daughter, Malia. She absolutely loves, loves, loves Harry Potter. And she is reading all the books and we're going through and we're going to watch the movies as she finishes the book. She's on the third book right now, which is my favorite. Um, but here is your little Hogwarts letter to Scentsy. And then there's little Velcros that attach to Hedwig's feet. So you just put it on 
And there she is. Oh my gosh, and she has her little spots on her wings. She is so soft. Oh my goodness. And her little tail. She says Scentsy. And her zipper's back here for her scent pack. So cute. Malia is going to love her. Oh, she has like a whole Harry Potter display up on her dresser. She has her Hogwarts warmer. She has like a bunch of the books. She has like little dolls. Um, she has Dumbledore, Professor McGonagall. She has Harry, Hermione, and Ron. Little dolls that she has like displayed on her dresser with her warmer. Um, and I think. Hedwig is going to find a nice spot up there if she doesn't sleep with her. But that is so cute. Oh my gosh. She is going to love her. Um, and Hedwig does come with your choice of scent pack. Typically the uh, licensed buddies have their own scent packs. Um, but for whatever reason, since he decided not to release the, any of the Harry Potter fragrances in the scent packs, so you will be able to pick from any of the available scent packs. Um, okay, let's go ahead and do wax next. got two of the Harvest Collection three packs and then I got a six pack of licensed. And then it looks like it's all here. So let's go ahead and go through the Harvard. No, let's do the Harry Potter first. So the six pack that I got is all Harry Potter items. Um, I got one of each Ravenclaw and Slytherin, which those are my absolute favorites from the original uh, Harry Potter collection. And then I got four of the new one, which is Wizarding World Harry Potter. Um, and there is the graphic. It's kind of dark, but the wax color is like this dark red color, like a maroon red. Ooh, this one actually kind of reminds me of Slytherin. Is it Slytherin? No, not really Slytherin. Maybe Ravenclaw. Maybe like a mix of the two. Anyways, so, Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Let me see if I can pull up the scent notes or the scent description for it while she comes down here. Oh, Kyrie, Kyrie. She's supposed to be taking her nap, but obviously she's right here. So. Okay, guess what she found. Come show them what you found. You show them? What'd you find? This. Aww. Isn't she cute? Yeah. Yeah. Me love her. You love her? 
So, the scent description for the Harry Potter bar is sparkling citrus and green apple illuminate mahogany woods while vanilla and a touch of amber Ooh, add yeah. warmth and charm. Mm, good. It is really good. Like you really, I can really smell like the woodiness to it. And the amber. I don't get citrus and I don't really get apple. Like nothing about this. Nothing about this is fruity to me. Here. Here. You want to open her up? You can open her. Maybe a little touch of fruitiness on the bottom. Oh, she's so cute. Do you love her? Yeah. But overall, it's a very like warm, woodsy scent. I really like it. But, like this is what Gryffindor should have been. You're welcome, baby. You wanna go play with her? Okay. You can take her. Just be quiet, okay? Mommy's doing scentsy stuff. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. hugs. Her name's Star. Mm. Can you say Star? Star. Star. Okay, take her. Go give her hugs. Okay. But I really do like this. Um, but yeah, this is what Gryffindor really should have been. So that is the six pack of licensed bars that I got. You're behind me? You're behind me? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's fine. You stay behind me. Okay, so let's go ahead and get to the harvest six pack. Well, not a six pack, I got two of the three packs. Uh, da, da, da. Let's go ahead and start with Cozy Vanilla and Pumpkin. It's pretty and orange, and I can actually get the descriptions for these two. You want to smell? Yeah. Okay, you can smell. Oh, store. Okay, so this one. Cozy vanilla pumpkin, fresh harvest pumpkin, and warm cozy vanilla finished with a sprinkle of sparkling cinnamon. Cinnamon? Ooh. Uh. What do you think? Do you like it? Mommy, I'll make it. No, that one's for your sister. That's Hedwig. I know. You open it? Not right now. You have Star. That one's your sister's. Okay, so this one. It is pumpkin-y, very pumpkin-y, but it's like a smoother Look. pumpkin. Oh, her tail. Oh, so soft. Yeah. Okay, come sit down. It is a very smooth pumpkin with a little bit of cinnamon. Like there's not really a whole bunch of cinnamon to it. But it is a very, like, creamy pumpkin. I really like this one. We go to mom. And then we will we go. go Dumbo. You're going to go show Dumbo? Mm -hmm. Okay, be very careful. And then Wild for Fall is the next one. And this one is Taken Towering Douglas Fir, while Satsuma Mandarin and Golden Sunflower add a new twist to your autumn adventure. And it is fresh and Christmas tree and very good. I do get kind of like a citrusy note. What was it? Mandarin, Satsuma Mandarin. Yeah, you definitely can get that on the bottom. 
Golden sunflower. Eh, not really. Hey, please don't go in the bathroom. You don't need water right now. Okay, I gotta hurry this up. So, maple rum cake then is a little slice of heaven brimming with buttered rum, cinnamon sugar, vanilla frosting, and a luscious maple drizzle. Ooh, it's kind of lighter. What are you doing up there? No, I told you, you don't need water. Please don't play in the water. Mm -mm. No, Kyrie. Ooh, the bottom smells burnt. No, never mind. I don't like this one. At least on cold. Like, the bottom has a weirdness to it. It smells burnt. That's interesting. Okay. The top's not that bad. Hmm. So let me grab these. I wanna see the pods are not bad. The pods are good. They don't smell burnt at all. I love you too, baby. Where's Star? Why didn't you bring her down? Oh, she's meeting Dumbo. Okay, that makes sense then. Okay, yeah. You want to go sleep, take a nap with Star? Okay, leave the water cup down here, okay? And go take a nap. Go lay down with Star. She's tired. She's had a long day. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Then go lay down. Star needs some quiet nap time, okay? Go show her how it's done. I much prefer the pods in the maple rum cake versus the wax. Hey, that's for Malia. Oh. Is she gonna like it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You smell? Mm. 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 Yeah, I much prefer the rum cake in all of the other products. <laughs> Maybe it's the rum. No, it smells burnt. I don't know. Okay, go take the box and go have a go take your nap with Star. No. No. Alright, next we're going to compare Wild Fur Fall. Mm-hmm. This one smells like it has more of like that crisp okay. note. Oops, I All right, it's okay. Oh. Go lay down with Star. Yeah, <laughs> We already put lotion on your hands, baby. Hey, wait. They do smell very similar. Hey, 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 hey. Kyrie. Hey, lucky. Here, smell this. You see myself. You see yourself? Mm. Yeah. Okay. okay, take Star's box up to your room. Can you take Star's we box up? Myself. We see you. Uh huh. Because Mama's making a video right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. All right. Can you go take Star's box up to her? No. Here, she wants her box. Okay. So let's just power through. Yeah. 
uh, that one, the the pad, the pods do really peekaboo peek match the bar. That's really nice. Hi, sorry about that. Uh, my camera cut out, so let me go ahead and pick up. Uh, where I believe I left off. Um, I believe I just finished up with the Wild for Fall comparison between the bar and the uh, pods. So now it is time for the Cozy Vanilla and Pumpkin. Um, hmm. All right, so. These smell quite similar to me too. The bar is a little less pumpkin than the pods. The pods actually remind me a lot of Scary Good. It's just not as sweet. But it is really good. The bar is definitely not as strong. It's not as like bold pumpkin either. Like after smelling the pods and then going back and smelling the bar, like it actually smells kind of like plain. Hmm. Yeah, so that is the Harvest three pack. Uh, eh, I'll find it. Um, so that's the Harvest three. Oh, they're right here. Perfect. Okay. So next, I did get two warmers. Um, and I did also purchase the whiff box, but I'm not going to do the whiff box in this video. I will do another one. So let me go ahead and start with the Harvest Pumpkin. It is the Fall Fairy Tale Warmer. I am so excited for this one. Okay, that's interesting. The interesting choice so it was just sitting like that on top okay. so this is the dish in the lid so there's your dish and your lid Here is the warmer, and it is a 20 watt. So here's the bulb. Ooh, what was that? Okay, just styrofoam. And here is the pumpkin. It has a little notch on the bottom for the cord. And so then the dish just sits right on top. And the lid, just like that. Um, so I will probably, in the end of this video, put up pictures of all of these warmers lit up. So this one and the other one that I have in there. Uh, I might even also include the Shining Light Warmer from a previous haul that I did because um, I wasn't able to light that one up. So, but this is the Fall Fairy Tale Pumpkin Warmer. I'm just going to put the bolt back in there. And then we are just going to move right along in there like that and then that one's in there like that okay so just gonna set 
that one aside, let's go ahead and get to the last item in this haul. And it is the platform nine and three quarters warmer. The new Harry Potter release. Let's express. There it is. No assembly required. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my goodness. It says. Hogwarts Castle on the side right here. And then it says Hogwarts Express 5972. Same on the back. And then right up here, you can see that it is leaving platforms nine and three quarters. And on the back, you know that it is between platforms nine and 10. So that is the brick wall that you just run into. And that is it. This is the dish where you put your wax. It is a element warmer. Uh, da, 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 da. Eight watts. This is an eight watt element warmer, which I can imagine that it's probably gonna be a pretty good warmer because it is open. Like there's no like lid here to hamper the scent throw. Um, and then I do know that these lights I want to say this horn like lights up there's an LED light in there but that is that and that is my harvest collection haul I hope you enjoyed I'm sorry for the distractions when Kyrie came down but hopefully she wasn't too distracting for everyone um, and I'm sorry about the middle where it got cut off when I was going through the harvest bars. It is what it is. Um, <laughs> I appreciate anyone that sticks with me and watches through to the end. Um, so yeah, thank you so much and thank you for watching and I hope you all have a wonderful day. Let me know down in the comments what you picked up in the harvest collection um, or what you uh, were interested in. Um, but yeah. Thank you so much. Bye.